Green Bay Packers fans are ready to see what Zadarius Smith can do on the field. They will have to wait for another four and a half months but fans got a preview of what Smith will look like in a Packers uniform. As soon as Smith signed his four-year, $66 million contract with the Packers, the team shared a photo of Smith in Packers gear. Smith shared the photo on Twitter and said he will wear no. 55 to honor his mentor Terrell Suggs since he played for the Baltimore Ravens the last four years. Here's a look at Smith in a Packers uniform, it's only right for me to wear that 55. Much respect to the... Here's a look at what NFL.com had to say about Smith. PFF credited Smith with 10 sacks, 17 QB hits and 33 hurries in the regular season, which is monster production for someone with 690 snaps. He plays with laudable fury, free agency is underway and the Packers are right in the middle of it, make sure you're in the loop, take 5 seconds to sign up for our free Packers newsletter now. The Packers getting Smith was not a real surprise since they were. Linked to him earlier in his career, Peter King of Pro Football Talk, NBC Sports, mentioned the Packers tried to trade for Smith at one point but they could not get a deal done, the Packers once tried to trade for Zadarius Smith, the Baltimore edge rusher, King wrote. Now, with a crying need on the edge, Green Bay could be a match with Smith in free agency. Last year, Smith had a breakout season, tallying 45 tackles, 10 tackles for loss and 8 sacks. He finished with a pro football focus grade of 71.7 which was the 33rd best grade for all edge defenders. Smith was drafted by the Ravens in the fourth round back in 2015. In his rookie season, Smith notched 30 tackles, 7 tackles for loss and 5.5 sacks. He took a step back in 2016, recording 20 tackles, 4 tackles for loss and 1 sack. Along with Smith, the Packers signed edge rusher Preston Smith, safety Adrian Amos and offensive lineman Billy Turner, so the Packers were very active in free agency which is something general manager Brian Gutekunst wanted. I'd like to be really active, Gutekunst said to NFL Network's Ian Rapoport on the Rap Sheet Friends podcast. It's a small market so we like to be part of a lot of the conversations. If the opportunity presents themselves, I think we'll be ready to pull the trigger. I'm excited to get it. The draft is how we build our team, but our team is ready to move in the free agent areas more than we have. The Packers may have overpaid for Zadarius Smith as he has never reached a Pro Bowl or an All-Pro team. But they needed to do that in order to secure one of the top free agent edge rushers on the market. If Smith continues to improve, the Packers' defense should make big strides in 2019.